Hey guys, it's Glenn from glenscarcollection.com. In this video, we're going to talk about how much money a YouTube channel with 10,000 subscribers makes. All right, guys, if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing. If you're already a subscriber, hit that notification bell so you don't miss my next video. I post three videos a week, every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. We have over 630 videos on this channel. All right, so we've been doing this channel about three years, and believe it or not, from what I hear from YouTube, is nine out of 10 YouTube channels will never make it to 10,000 subscribers. So believe it or not, even though that's still a small number, as you know, I'm sure your favorite YouTube channel has millions of subscribers, still uh, 10,000 is a milestone, and I think I get a, a YouTube button or something like that, because I think they do it at 10, 10,000 subscribers, 100,000, and then a million. There should be stuff in between. That's a big difference between having 10,000 and 100, and obviously 100 and a million. Now, so what does the channel make? You all see that somebody buys a Lamborghini at 21 years old, and uh, you know they have movie quality videos. Well, those people sank either, maybe their fathers did, but somebody sank a lot of money in that channel to do it. So that's not your typical channel. But your regular YouTube channel like mine, uh, that's obviously on a budget because it costs, costs money to make these videos, you know, gas, mileage, tolls, uh, your time. Uh, I'm a commercial real estate broker. is my full-time job. So obviously if I'm shooting YouTube videos, I'm not prospecting for real estate clients or, and believe it, real estate commissions pay a lot more uh, than YouTube will ever pay. But that's a common question I get with 10,000 subscribers. How much did YouTube make? A lot of people think you make a lot of money with the channel, and uh, unfortunately, that's not true. Uh, now, they've changed the rules. So my channel's been around three years, so I'm still under the old rules. I think for the uh, new channels, you have to have a certain amount of views per month to, uh, to monetize your channel. And a lot of channels, when you're starting out, you probably shouldn't monetize your channel at all because you kind of want to build viewers and get them hooked on your channel first. Now, if you want to make money, the last thing you should do is a car channel. I do it because I love cars. I love talking about them. I love driving about them. And I just wanted to turn the camera on while I do all that and share those experiences with you. I always wish that there was an outlet, uh, you know, how is this car like to drive? How is that car like to drive? So, you know, I buy these cars with my own money. I've had over a hundred of them and I keep them for a couple of years. I like switching my cars every year or two. So you really see how it is to uh, live with them on a daily basis over a period of time. If they go up in value, depreciate, what it costs to maintain them, uh, et cetera, et cetera, how to buy them, how to sell them. But, uh, you know, that's probably not your typical channel. So, uh, 10,000 subscribers, which is still, believe it or not, better than 9 out of 10, which I can't imagine. So the statistics I have from YouTube is that there's actually 6, 6 million YouTube channels, and I'm sure a couple million are being added every year as it gets more popular. Everybody has, seems to have a YouTube channel now. And uh, I'm ranked like number 600,000, so that believe it or not, that's in the top 10%. Now, I'm filming this just before I have 10,000 subscribers. I'm about 200 away, a little less than that. So if you look here and I have less than 10,000 subscribers, please hit that subscribe button so maybe we can get me over right now and uh, then I can do more videos on it. So when you first start your channel, you're not going to make any money. I mean, your your videos will make pennies. Uh, you may, I mean, typically you have to get a thousand views on YouTube to get one tenth of a penny, I believe. So, uh, you know, you need or a thousand views to get a penny or something like that. I forget the statistic and I'm off, off there, but... Uh, yeah, so it's not like you post a video, get 10,000 views, you get all this money. You got a uh, dollar or something like that. So for 10,000 subscribers, and it changes, okay? So when you first, you probably won't make any money your first year. Maybe you make $1,000 or something like that. And then maybe the second year, you'll make 2,000. Maybe the third year, you'll make 4,000. And that's pretty much what's uh, come on this channel. So, uh, and again... It may be, I may be doing this a week or two in advance before that I actually post it because I have other videos to get out. And uh, my channel's made just under 9,000 videos in three years. So it hasn't been 3,000 a year. It was probably, you know, 1,000 the first year, uh, you know, whatever, 3,000 the second year, and maybe 5,000 this year or something like that. So it's not a big number. You really have to do it as a labor of love. Uh, you know, I get up. Uh, like I said, I do, I'm a commercial real estate broker full time, so I can't do any editing or filming. I got to do it very late at night or very early in the morning. So, uh, you know, I'm up when it's dark before you're up or while you're sleeping, I'm editing videos, getting, uh, only a couple hours of sleep a night to get these videos out on time. Uh, you know, while the topics are still, uh, 
people are looking for that. So that's kind of what a YouTube channel makes. So you really have to do it because you like it. And if you really want to make money on YouTube and it has to be YouTube, you know, I want to do a car channel, do something with entertainment or edu or educating people on whatever topic you're an expert at. And you'll get more followers that way. Very few, you know, 0 0.000001 percent of people are into cars and manual transmissions. We think there's a lot of us, but there really isn't. That's why we kind of all watch the same channels. But, uh, you know, I'm already three years into it. I'm going to keep doing it as long as I'm able to, just because I love sharing my experiences and I love reading all the comments and hearing from you. And I've gotten to drive a lot of cool cars. We've had some, uh, we've had, you know, most of my cars that I review uh, come from subscribers. So that's really cool that we get to experience so, so uh, many cars. And, you know, I think I have an open mind for different cars because I like a, a very... A uh, varied amount of them, and I think you know, driving other people's cars, you appreciate some cars. You know, some cars I never drove before, and I said, "Wow, this is a really good car." You know, where's this car been my whole life? But uh, so it's been it's been interesting. Uh, again, help me to get ten thousand subscribers. We hit this, hit the subscribe button, and uh, we should have a lot of great comments. So subscribers are important, really, for your channel. And uh, it's like the old saying: it takes money to make money. The more subscribers you have, the more doors open up for you. So if you want to, you know, get a press car or something, nobody's giving you that at 10,000 subscribers. I go to uh, press days where I'm invited to, where whole groups of people go, maybe a hundred of it, and we share those 50 cars that are there or something like that. You know, you probably have to have 50,000 or 100,000 subscribers to actually, uh, you know, get press cars. So how many views does the channel get? Uh, a month. So the views for a month, I probably average about seventy-five to 80,000 views a month. Again, I have 630 videos, so that certainly helps. Uh, you know, when my channel does has a great month, it's probably 100,000 views a month. When you have a bad month, it's probably 60,000 views a month. So typically in a month, it's somewhere in the, I think the most I ever made in a month was $500. But typically, it's around two fifty to three hundred dollars is the typical month. If I have one video that did really well, or a couple videos that did really well, then obviously that can boost it to three, four hundred, five hundred dollars a month. But you know, typically a video will die out. It'll do the most in the first forty-eight hours or so. And uh, for subscribers, do you know if you have a good video? If you have, let's just use ten thousand because it's even number. You you should get a thousand views per video. That's so usually ten percent because people may have subscribed for different reasons. People may have subscribed because of this car, the E46 M3. They may have subscribed because of my McLaren or uh, my 1M or something like that. So they may only watch videos when you posted that certain car. Or maybe somebody just likes car reviews, or maybe somebody just likes vlogs. So from what I'm told from YouTube is, if 10% of your viewers watch the video, that's that's where you should be. So if I have 10,000 subscribers, just to use a round number each of my videos should get a thousand views. So some will only get 300 views and then others will get a hundred thousand views. So it really kind of depends what that topic is. And sometime, uh, you know, that's just it. Sometimes there's no rhyme or reason. Sometimes you think you make a great video and maybe people weren't searching for it. So that's really how people find your videos. It's not so much you uh, telling all your friends to subscribe. If YouTube thinks they have a lot of likes, people are watching the video, like a big percentage of it, not 10% of the video, but 70, 80% of the video. And it's longer, they typically like videos, like in that 18 minute uh, time range, not three minute videos or 30 minute videos. And uh, then they'll promote the video more. And that's really what, what drives the views and drives your channel. YouTube kind of has an algorithm. They know what you like. They know what I like when I watch videos. Like my commercials, for example, if I watch somebody else's channel, my commercials are always car commercials because the only videos I watch on YouTube are car videos and, uh, and car reviews. So those are the commercials I get. So you, what you get on commercials is probably what you're viewing most for YouTube. So that kind of tells you uh, what a 10,000 subscriber channel makes. It's not very much. I'm sure you're sorely disappointed. I was. If I knew this, this in the beginning, I probably would have never started a YouTube channel. But, uh, you know, I like doing it. I like to meet new people. I like to drive all these different cars and have all these experience. There's no way I'm going to be able to own 630 cars. So one way to drive those cars is obviously uh, have a YouTube channel. But if I was going to do it over again, I would do it on another topic that's more searched on YouTube. All right, guys. So remember, hit the subscribe button, notification bell, like this video, share it, and leave your comments below. Thanks again for watching. And I will see you next time.